Next week you come to the stage doing her thing. All of them for the comedy scene. You guys gonna love them. Please show me love for Brenda! Thank you, thank you. By a round of applause, who wants to hear Jerry Seinfeld impression? What's the deal with Jeffrey Epstein? I dated a 17-year-old girl in the 90s. It was great. No one cared. That's <laughs> true. Now you know that if you didn't. Uh, I was talking to someone today, and it's like, people, when they meet me, I seem kind of gay, but like not fully. Like you can't come to a firm conclusion about it. And I don't seem like fun gay. I seem kind of like sinister Vincent Price, 1950s evil gay. <laughs> like, I look like I like tap people's toes and give them a wink and we talk in secret slang and then have like satanic sodomy and sniff poppers and shit. Uh, <laughs> or it's like I capture somebody and I'm like, hmm. My muscular Hitler youth clones will restrain you, and then my laser will shoot at your penis while you're in bondage. Mm, and I'll watch it. That's what they think. I'm not really like that. I'm waiting for a disability case to go through. I have a legit disease, though, but it feels like the world's longest job interview. Like. <laughs> And it's like they're mad at you for showing up after you read the ad. They're like, oh, fuck, another one? Oh, we gotta take that ad down. And it's like, man, I've never seen someone work so hard for less than minimum wage. It's not time. Uh, isn't it crazy that we hold Pee Wee Herman to a higher standard than we do the president? You know, all Pee Wee Herman did was touch himself. You know, it's not like he Louis C.K. somebody. You know, I feel like Louis C.K. should have to host The Price is Right for like five years <laughs> until we take him back. Or, you know, we could put him in front of a full-length mirror, like at a ballet studio, and make him watch himself masturbate. <laughs> or, worst of all, you can make him watch me masturbate. Now that's a chilling sight. You know, it's kind of like when you see those depressing people playing video poker in a bar, and their eyes are just like half focused. It's like slap the button, burst of color, remorse. Same sad cycle for me. <laughs> well, I guess I better jerk off to get that remorse off my mind. You know, my, uh, my girlfriend's got a two-year-old kid and she's always worried that I'm gonna leave something swallowable around or like drugs for the kid to swallow. And I'm like, you know, it's like spiders. You're gonna swallow like nine of them in your lifetime. It's, you know, it's, it's like chicken pox. You gotta get it out of the way. <laughs> My graffiti tag is no trespassing, but like no one ever like thinks it's intentional. Get no credit for it. Sometimes I just do like big rectangles over other people's shit. Uh, <laughs> that's fun. <laughs> I wish I was clairvoyant. Like I, like I've sat there and I've really tried to focus and see you know, into the other realm. Uh, but I'm like the opposite of a psychic. Like I can't even figure out what's going on right now much less see into the future. <laughs> uh, I read WebMD a lot. Uh, it turns out I have a bunch of uh, crazy diseases. Uh, I have like Lou Gehrig's disease. I have uh, unbalanced tumors, hysterical leprosy, and I've got one hour Parkinson's disease. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I read WebMD a lot. You know, it turns out I'm a delusional schizophrenic. You know, I got this delusion that I'm a hypochondriac. You know, I, I, sometimes I'm worried I'm going to develop the delusion that I'm gay. 
not because I think being gay is wrong, but because like, I'm worried I can evolve into a congressman or an evangelical preacher. Like, there's a lot of those, and they all seem to be gay. And George Bush is a pedophile. Uh, I, uh, I really want to die, so I just start talking shit about the CIA. Like, in front of Congress, they got proven that they assassinated over nine leaders of uh, formerly colonized nations that were trying to go socialist, put their resources together, and then uh, CIA just shoots them. Uh, so I'm just, uh, and hopefully someone shoots me right now uh, for saying I'm mad. They also invented crack. I'm waiting for the light, I don't know. <laughs> Oh, the red light needs to go? Okay. Thank you. Uh, I have a band. It's called Black Velvet Petunia, like the flower. Best band in the Pacific Northwest. Uh, honestly, it's like punk, blues, badass. Thank you.